I'm Maria Jenkins, I'm from Leonville High School, and my big idea was Murray's Boarding and Grooming. Have you ever wanted to go on a luxurious vacation but can't because you have a dog to take care of? Has your dog ever needed a well-earned spa day? Well, no worries. Come on down to Maria's Boarding and Grooming. We offer quality services with reasonably priced uh, services including boarding, bathing, dematting, and more. Maria's Boarding and Grooming is located north of Aberdeen on Highway 281. Don't hesitate. Reserve your spot today by calling 605-216-7472. Maria's Boarding and Grooming is tailored to dog owners, anybody that has like a family pet or furry babies. Uh, the grooming part, you can have anywhere from trimming their nails to having a haircut or bathing. Boarding, we have multiple kennels for your different dogs of any kind of behavior. And we also would like them to have, especially call ahead to make sure that we do have room. Our drawbacks to our business are that we are uh, we are a small business, but we are mighty. Our benefits are that uh, when your dog comes to the groomers, they have a healthy coat, and they also it, um, they also it's easy to detect illnesses and any diseases that might be wrong with your dog. And it's helpful to have uh, trim puppies' nails to make sure that their foot growth is proper. Uh, boarding, our boarding and grooming service, we are two-in-one, so if you are going out of town and you need your dog to be groomed, you can also board them with us. There are a lot of competitors around Aberdeen, including uh, the Pet Place, which they only do grooming, and Dakota Kennel, which they only do boarding, but we do, do, we do offer both. A uh, unique aspect about our business is that we do have a personal touch, so when you bring your pet in, uh, we will set them up with the same groomer every time to make sure that they do get comfortable and they're not nervous at all. Uh, we also tend to all breeds, so anywhere from a Chihuahua, a Great Dane, a Husky, anything. We also have large outdoor enclosures to uh, let them run around in because it is good for dogs to exercise. Our strengths is that, again, we are a two-in-one business and we are the only business in Aberdeen that would offer this. Uh, our weaknesses are definitely... Uh, that during the slow times, we would it would be hard to uh, come up with the money because expenses need to be paid. The dog boarding and grooming business is a large industry due to the advances in technology. It's easier to get around from here to there, and uh, now that it is easier that you can board and groom your dog anywhere, and it's easier. Uh, Advertising, we would definitely advertise uh, on the radio or in the newspaper, through social media, and definitely through our customers. Our startup costs uh, would include rent, which would be utilities, and a zoning permit would be another one. Uh, supplies would include anywhere from nail clippers to trim their nails, uh, slicker brushes for brushing them. Monthly expenses would include, again, rent and then blades for the clippers for when we give our dogs haircuts. Uh, pricing, we uh, offer a lot of different things, including haircuts and other things like de-skunking and dematting. Uh, employee qualifications, we would like employees to either have a GED or a high school diploma and also have a certification in dog boarding school. We would like our employees to have a good work ethic, be personable, to be able to talk to employees and other customers, and have a good attitude towards work. We would also like them to re be res respectful to your animals. Um, our facilities would be a 100 by 80 square foot building with a lot of outdoor space for your animal. And our business hours would be, eight to five would be for uh, grooming and uh, Boarding would definitely be flexible because you can pick up your dog anytime you want. Awesome. So, is this something you plan to do? No. Okay. <laughs> Have you done it before? No. Okay.
Um, tell me about this nice hand up. So tell me how you came up with some of your startup costs, uh, your other operational expenses. Did you do um, some research? Or? I did a little research, and we also board my dog up by Ellendale, so I got some of her prices and kind of went off of that. Got it. So zoning permit of three thousand dollars. He's an attorney, so I suppose twenty five hundred. Twenty eight hundred. Twenty eight hundred. Would you merge your co brand or cooperate with the uh, veterinarian? Maybe would that be? Mm. Would that make some sense for this kind of a business? Uh, I guess if you were to do like anal gland expression, which uh, it's you clean out the anal gland of the dog, that would be more like a vet thing, which we wouldn't offer that. Thanks. All right. Thank You're you. You're welcome.